can a smartphone replace a proper camera? Hi everyone, this is JD, your gadget review friend. In this day and age, you can actually use a smartphone to do professional work like vlogging or phone photography. And for some of you that doesn't know, this whole channel started using a smartphone. But obviously, over time, we moved to a proper camera. So today, we'll talk about this, the advantages of a smartphone, the unique thing about the camera, and can the smartphone replace a proper camera? Let's go to work. Let's start with the advantages of the smartphone. The first thing is there's a lot of camera filters and tricks. And the best part is everything is dialed in. Normally under photo settings, you will see either AI or effect, and you will see monochrome, vivid, show just a specific color or long exposure. Everything is one click, everything is automatic. Smartphones are also pocketable and not just small in size, it is slim in size. So when you put this in your pocket, no one's gonna notice. So it's a perfect vlogging camera because you can bring it anywhere. The smartphones are also discreet. And I'm not talking about the size, but the idea of shooting with the phone. In our generation today, you will always see people in the road shooting their phones. So it become a normal thing. So when you start to hold the phone in public and shoot, no one's gonna care. Next is the night sight feature, and this is more for phone photographers. Over time, this became really popular because smartphones can now see in the dark. It can even shoot Milky Ways and stars now. Camera needs three things, a long shutter speed, a wide lens, and a tripod. And because the phone's a smaller sensor, it is possible for manufacturers to put EIS or OIS for smoother video. Imagine a camera so slim and so small, and yet not needing any gimbal or expensive camera body for super steady movement. The next thing I like about the smartphones are there are tons of editing software or tools that you can use for photos and videos. You can edit an image or video straight from your phone and upload it to YouTube or other social media platforms. It eliminates a file transfer and saves you a lot of time. The next advantage are the multiple lenses. I mean, when is the last time you saw a phone with a single camera? I think the only one is iPhone SE 2022, which is the affordable version of an iPhone. And you know, Apple will cut lots of things for a cheaper price. Now you can shoot in different focal lengths like wide, ultra-wide, telephoto, and macro. And the best part, most of them has fast aperture. The next advantage is water resistance. You'll notice that majority of mid-range and flagship smartphones have water resistance that eliminates the need of an action camera. Because of the stabilization in water resistance, you can bring this anywhere. And the last advantage of the smartphones is it is cheaper. A $1,000 smartphone is different from a $1,000 camera. For smartphones, you will probably get all the nice features of a flagship phone, while $1,000 will only get you to an entry-level camera. And you still have to buy lenses for a particular shooting you need. So all in all, there's so much advantage of using a phone. Next, let's talk about the unique features of a camera. First is versatility. You cannot replace the versatility of cameras. Especially if the camera model and brand are well known, you will find almost every lenses for different shooting with different brands. If you invested enough on your lenses, you can create some really good film quality videos and professional photos. The next unique thing about camera is better images and videos. And this is true if you have a camera with bigger sensors, let's say a micro four thirds, an APS-C or full frame less noise, better subject separation, and better low light shots. And when we talk about low light shots, these are night shots that are natural looking. You will also notice less sharpening on photos and videos. And when we talk about the looks, the cameras will produce natural looking photos and videos. You can shoot your images in raw or flat profile on videos. Then you can color grade later. Smartphones tend to over sharpen and oversaturate colors because they compensate on smaller sensors. Next thing about cameras is it teaches you to become a better photographer or filmmaker. Because you need to dial in every single thing on the cameras, whether it's shutter speed, aperture, or ISO, you will learn the basics and science of the cameras, and you will grow over time using a proper camera. That brings us to the next unique feature, which is full control. And this type of control will give you different results. For smartphones, because of the smaller sensor, you can only do so much. It's more of a point and shoot, and you will get what it feeds you. 
And lastly, the fulfillment and enjoyment of shooting. If this is something you want to grow with, like a hobby or a real professional work, there's fulfillment and enjoyment using a proper camera. You got all the tools, it is so much powerful and versatile. The cameras are certainly sliding to a more professional and serious work. And that leaves us with our final question, can a smartphone replace a proper camera? The simple answer is yes, as long as the function you need can be provided by a smartphone, yes, definitely. This is gearing towards casual and personal consumption, professional work like vlogging and YouTube is possible. Remember, people will watch you not because of your gear, but because of your personality. For as long as the smartphone can record better video quality like 4K, there's no need of a camera. On the flip side, it cannot replace a camera if you're getting paid to deliver amazing quality output like videos or photos for an event. Everyone is using a smartphone, and if you use a smartphone, they may not need you. Cameras are also used for b-rolls in YouTube as it gives you a more cinematic look. Smartphones can replace cameras for vlogging and casual shoot, but for professional and filmmaking work, with the current smartphone technology, no. Cameras are miles ahead of smartphones. If you're contemplating of using a smartphone or a camera for your YouTube work, always remember it's not about the gear, it's the personality. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.